What is going on guys and before me right here on the screen you can see that the team of the year has been released. This is the first one the community team of the year and we are going to try and pull it but we are going to try and pull it in a special way. We still have the pack opening giveaway coming out on Friday but what we have amassed right now is a bunch of collection packs. We have 50 of them right here. On the next week we are going to open up 100 collection packs, the following week 150 collection packs, and then the final week with the Offensive Team of the Year, we are going to open 200 collection packs. So it is going to be unreal. We're just going to try and pull a Team of the Year card. Whatever happens, happens. We're just going to, we're just going to pull it. And this right now is on my uh, Give and Take episode. Um, channel so if we do pull anything we're not going to use it we're just going to see you know how many collection packs it is going to take to pull a team of the year if we can pull any team of the years so let's just get into it right now we're going to start these packs we are just going to blow through them simple as that we are just going to keep trucking along just keep blasting through these we're gonna hope, <laughs> hope we can get something out of these packs. Just something good. Wait for a nice team of the year to come around. Oh my God! The third pack in, we get a team of the year, Dougie Hamilton. Are you serious? I just watched a Twitch stream <laughs> of four EA popular EA YouTubers open 50 17K packs, and we pull a Dougie Hamilton on the third collection pack oh my god <laughs> are you serious holy crap Dougie Hamilton on the third pack team of the year on the third pack there are two available right now two available good lord that is insane <laughs> guys what is going on well I mean we're gonna keep him just so we can you know keep looking at his handsome face I didn't even see what was in the rest of the pack. That's amazing. Holy cow. That is unreal. Good stuff right there. All right. So we have that out of the way. <laughs> Guys, it takes... <laughs> it takes three collection packs to pull a team of the year. Are you freaking kidding me? Wow. That is unreal. Absolutely unreal. We are still trucking along here. We have gotten a every pack we let's see, 20% success rate in pulling a team of the year, no matter what pack it was. We have a 20% success rate on pulling these team of the years. Un freaking real. I can't believe that happened. That is that is some insane luck right there. And hey, you know, I guess I could end the series right there, but why would I do that? I would love to open up 400 more collection packs that is just insane guys i cannot believe that third pack in like jesus and we're we're blowing through these right now as i said before you know we can't use anything on this channel because this is the series this is a series channel in which we only can use the players that we pull in the packs you know it doesn't matter if we get a uh a team of the week, Dougie Hamilton, team of the year, Dougie Hamilton, or if we pull a Novechkin out of these, we cannot use anything, cannot use anything that comes in these packs, and we are just going to absolutely blast through these packs. It's already paid off. We have got a Dougie Hamilton already, and you know, I'm not saving any for collection. You know, I'm just blowing through these, ripping them, grip it and rip it, as they used to say. What video game was that? Grip it and rip it. That was like Hot Wheels on the N64. That was a fun racing game. Shout out to anybody who knows what I'm talking about. That was a very interesting game back then. <laughs> Graphics didn't, or er, uh, gravity didn't really make sense in that one. I, I love how we like haven't pulled an 85 yet. I think we pulled a Helm once, but we really haven't pulled anything except that Team of the Year Dougie Hamilton. Why couldn't we have pulled that in like when I actually did this giveaway or this uh this thing for real? I probably just ruined the luck on this channel. 
Uh, anywho, that was wow, what a blast. Third pack in, Dougie Hamilton. Unreal. Unfreaking real. That's amazing. That's incredible. I can't even believe that happened. I'm still in shock. Like, I was like, you know, I watched them blow through 217k packs and not one of those streamers. It was like so many popular YouTube streamers. It was on Twitch, happened about 6 o'clock Central Time, 7 o'clock Eastern Time. They just ripped through almost 200 packs. And then I think they opened some player premium packs and, uh, and then got some... I mean, they got some alright stuff. They got a few milestone cards. They got a few... Uh, let's see, they got... I think there were a few McKinnons that went by. I think we saw a Carey Price at one point. But, yeah, like, they spent almost a million pucks that EA gave all those packs to them. They didn't pull a thing, and it took us three collection packs. That's Lefty right there. Man, we lost to Toronto last night. That sucked. <laughs> that blowed. But... Nonetheless, we're just still ripping and ripping these packs. We've got like a thousand foot sale value so far out of these packs. That's good stuff. I mean, we can't sell anything in these packs, so you know, what we do with it is whatever. And I don't really, I don't boost my players. I don't really, we don't really ever need any, uh, hey, John Scott, what's going on? We don't really need recovery cards either because we only have one loss on this channel, on this give and take channel. So... I mean, we can't really hold on to this stuff, so whenever we, whenever we pull, we're going to discard. I mean, we, we didn't discard that Dougie Hamilton, because, I mean, that's a pretty color to look at. We get to see it in our collection. It's fun. Maybe uh, maybe once the series ends, maybe once we uh, destroy Division 1, that we will be able to, I don't know, play play uh, some of the subscribers with this channel. I got, ooh, 1,000 pucks right there. That's a nice little addition. Oh, it's funny, whenever you do these collections, there's always that one D-bag on the market who takes this super unrare player and just makes, makes like, buys them all out and then puts them for 4,000 bucks. It sucks. And then I'm sitting there thinking, I'm like, do I really want to, you know, blow $4,000 on a uh, grant from Arizona? <laughs> like, not really. And I almost did it, but I just went to bed. I'm like, I'll get you in the morning. And then I found, like, 600 bucks the next day. So don't, don't, don't give in to those crummy tactics on the auction house. It's no fun for anybody. We're going to see. We have not gotten a damn thing since that Dougie Hamilton. And at this point, I really don't care. Because, I mean, that's awesome. That's exactly what we were trying to do on this on this pack opening. I uh, just wanted to see how long it would take to get a team of the year. And, God, if this channel doesn't skew the odds for what it should be. I mean, 200 packs on the Twitch streams. Those guys didn't pull a thing. Okay, TJ Oshi right there. A thousand more pucks. Not bad gonna salvage a little bit of coinage out of this pack opening we have 50 of these collection packs right now we're just ripping them seeing if we can get a team of the year we got one and we are this is the first installment as i said 50 packs this opening 100 packs the next opening 150 for the following and 200 to round it out we're gonna do each of that the day of or the day after that next part of team of the year comes out I'm not sure what comes next. It might be Defensive Team of the Year. No, I think it's uh, the Rookies or the, the Under-23 comes out next, and then the Defensive, and then the Offensive. Man, nothing good so far. I guess the uh, the pack luck is returning. Oh, Cam Neely Legend card. All right. That's another solid pull. Right as I said that, I'm like, luck's died out. Oh, boom, Legend card right there. Uh, let me know if you guys still want to do a Laugh Out Legend. I know the price of them are dropping. Maybe we can snag a Wah or a Lindstrom or something. I want to do a position that we haven't grabbed yet if you guys want to continue to do that series. Maybe back and grab a Team of the Year and we can do a Laugh Out Team of the Year. It doesn't really flow, but you know. Okay, so we don't have many many packs left. We blew through about 40 of them already, so we're just going to you know finish off the first one. We got that Cam Neely. And we got the Dougie Hamilton in the second pack. I guess I could be, you know, picking the cards that I don't have yet, setting them to the collection, but I mean, that's no fun. I've gotten a few of the collections. I've traded them between two or three other accounts that I've created, so we are going to be hopping in between accounts once we have more than 50 packs, which is going to be the next pack opening. It'll be this channel once again with a new set of collections and then the secondary channel with the collections that have, I guess, accessed me to these packs right here. So we'll just consistently keep switching uh, the collections in between 
the different accounts and reaping the benefits from that. I guess I could keep doing this after the uh, team of the year is over with. If you wanted me, I could just, you know, get 50 packs and then just run through them on one account. Seeing if we can't get the team of the team of the week or, you know, Stanley Cup edition when those start to come out. Might be fun if you guys just have a, uh, I guess, an addiction like I do for ripping packs. I mean, this is a, a good, safe way to do it. If you guys have, I don't know, 150,000 pucks, you can successfully obtain 50, uh, 50 packs of this, of this nature. I think it only took me six or seven collections. So, yeah, it's, it's pretty harmless. You don't waste that much money, you know, play for a good while, you know, maybe you might have to sell off a player or so, but then you get to rip 50 packs. And you can, if you're on PlayStation, you know, create a new account, just transfer those players over and then rip them through the 50 again. Maybe, I know some people do that. They, they successfully transfer all of their, uh, all their cards over to all the accounts see what they get. But this is the last pack. We're going to let this one play out. Hopefully we can get one more good card. Nicholas Yalmerson, that's going to do it for this edition of the Collection Polls Team of the Year Hunt. So let's go back to our collection and prove to you that I have not gone out of my mind. We are going to search through all the players and feast our eyes on that beautiful Dougie Hamilton right there. And don't be fooled by this Sergei Bobrovsky right there. These are some of the players that I've had to get on this account so that I could complete the collection. As you can see, these are the kind of players that you're going to need to buy. And right now, they're super cheap on the auction house because people are selling all they can so that they can buy more packs. And make sure, if, if you want to do this method of just getting a bunch of collection, you know, you, I picked up a Cam Neely and I picked up a Dougie Hamilton Team of the Year. That's fantastic, but we have three more episodes of this coming out. The next one will come out the day or the day after the under 23. I'm hoping for that Kucherov. Probably going to buy one eventually, but that's all you got to do. I hope you guys enjoyed this pack opening just to see that team of the year. It was a sight for sore eyes since I had seen so many people with bad luck. I didn't, I really I was like, damn, I don't think I'm, I'll be able to pull it after with just these collection pulls. They were ripping, you know, 17K packs. Just unreal. We finally got one. If you guys like this and you'd like to see more of these things, let me know in the comment section. Leave a like, comment on the video, and subscribe to the channel to see more of this stuff. And until next time, guys, this is Pack Daddy. I'm out.